Uh, they're quoting a comment I made on the forum regarding uh, how I don't want to hear about, or excuse me, I'm not interested in ideas about the Illuminati, the New World Order, Aliens, 2012, and the like. And they go on to say that this is turning into a clubhouse of banned topics and specific thinking, and it's not about truth, and to ignore certain aspects of the conspiracy that don't fit within my worldview makes me no different than Alex Jones. So I have to ask, is this movement about truth, or are you implementing the New World Order? <laughs> well, first of all, the reason I point out those points is because they don't do anything. They don't do anything. It does nothing to sit there and tell somebody that there's some ruling elite of secret society Satanists that uh, want to dominate the world and assassinate a great majority of the world population. Even if that was true, which it isn't, it, even if that was true, it does absolutely nothing. What are people going to do? They're just going to run around with their head cut off looking for invisible enemies. The reason I don't talk about metaphysical or conspiratorial things on that level is because I want to focus on what will actually create positive change. I want to, I want, if you show people the light as opposed to the dark, the dark doesn't even matter anymore because they'll have a direction they can march through to. And that's really the most important, important point. The greatest form of activism isn't the constant exposure of corporate and governmental fraud and you know, all of the things that have been going on since the dawn of civilization and the scarcity-driven world that we live in. Um, we're really barely out of the jungle on this planet. The real activism comes from giving the solution, having people identify with that solution, and then moving forward with that solution. And when that, that becomes powerful enough, all of the little secret society groups and all of the, all of the so-called elite, they'll be, they'll be trampled because they have nothing. It's such a small vicinity of people that think in the truly despotic ways. All they have is the military and the police, and that's something that uh, we'll eventually have to get to next. Um, we have to have a, a complete awakening in the military and the police because, because basically uh, this is it. This is, they're, they're the ones that have been conditioned to move against the people, and if we can get to them, it's over. The establishment's over. Uh, as far as the other points, uh, no, the reason I don't talk about aliens in 2012 is because there's no point in it. I, there's, uh, full of, you know, prophecy and things like this. Unless you can prove to me aliens have some relevance to the one person dying every second from starvation, I don't want to hear about it. I don't care. If there are aliens, well, have them land. I'll be great to meet them. I, I, it's not of interest to me. 2012 prophecy, 2012 is a religious notion. Uh, I couldn't care less about that either. Go ahead and talk about it. We have a miscellaneous section now. If you want to talk about it, if you feel it's relevant, then work it out. Get feedback from your fellow man. That's great. But, um, I, I, you know, that's just not relevant.